Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Gavin from the Gavin and Cali series, and today I'm doing a uh, video, first video, on a texture pack that I basically worked on myself. It's the Gavin and Cali texture pack, which is pretty cool. Um, I didn't entirely make this texture pack, I was going to, but I really suck at drawing and just texturing and stuff like that. What I did was I took uh, some textures from the Painterly Pack Customizer Pack. Uh, that is in the description, so click there if you want to go there. And also some textures to the uh, Mini Doku uh, Texture Pack Customizer, and that's also in the description. So it's easy as uh, opening up your Texture Pack folder, dragging stuff in, and just click Gavin Kelly Texture Pack. As you can see, you have some nice uh, familiar Doku texture pack, well texture GUI stuff like that. So we'll press single player, um, just do creative mode, um, I don't really think any of this matters. Just wait for it to load up. And moan, bleh, mostly all of the texture, like terrain, is painfully packed, but there is some uh, what do you call it? Doku craft involved in it. Uh, for some, well, for example, I believe the dirt here is Doku. All of the mobs, except for the cats, the Siamese cats, are, are Doku. Um, I believe these reeds are painterly. Anyway, that's beside the point. Um, I really like these buckets. I mean, these, uh, so you got the nice, uh, wooden buckets instead of iron here, which I think looks really good. And I also really like the, the black books, and if you get a book and quill, you see that in the back it's black instead of uh, brown or whatever. Um, I made so all of the enchanting stuff is um, like vials, I think you pronounce it. Um, and if they have like this red thing around it, that's like a splash potion, like that. And I think that's pretty cool. Um, I also added like every single GUI is blue, um, except for the this thing right here. So if I type um, game mode survival, I'll be in survival mode. Um, and then if I open up my inventory, as you can see, it's all blue. And that's, um, that's for every, uh, that's for, like, crafting benches and furnaces. And so if I get crafting bench, let's say I get a furnace, a dispenser, one log, that blue, 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 which I think is pretty cool. Because I think it's a nice color. Um, the I made it so that um, I put most. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I have no idea. There's some Doku and some uh, Painterly in the tools. Um, the pickaxes look really nice. Um, I think the swords look really nice. Um, I'm, I distinctly remember that the stone sword is from the Painterly pack. Um, I also added it so that chainmail is sort of like a um, it's like this worker builder thing, which looks pretty cool. That could be useful for like admin, admins and stuff like that. I think that looks really nice there. Let's get rid of that. I don't know why I'm doing that. Okay, whatever. Um. I what else? Um, I have the nice uh, wood textures, which I look. I think look really nice. All the wood. Um, I think the stone slabs look excellent. I mean, look at that. That's great. The water is a light blue, and as you can see, you can see all the way down, which is pretty good. It's nice. A nice light blue. I think it looks good. Um, I th think all of the ores and stone. I think they're part of the Doku pack. I believe. There you go, there's some nice ones. Um, there's a piggy. Piggies look nice. 
Um, I don't think I changed the color of the Ender Dragon. Um, but if I get a villager, right, what's this? And I spawn a couple. As you see, they have a cool little. They kind of look like pigs. Which is pretty cool. And this guy's would give me. I changed the emeralds so that they look like uh, gold uh, coins, which is really cool. You could use them as like a currency and stuff like that. Um, and then you. I guess that's pretty cool. You enchant stuff. He's got like any bookshelves. Anyway, um, what else I find is cool is if I get, um, actually let's grab this too. If I grab a zombie pigment and I spawn one, oh, I guess that didn't work. Okay. Well, it was supposed to be that it's not a zombie pigment anymore. It's just a, re it's just a regular pigment. But, okay. That works too. Oh, I guess the enderman didn't work in. I would either. Oh, well, that doesn't work. That's fine. Um, what else is there? Um, there's these nice, all of these blocks, like the, like the ore blocks, they look really nice. Okay. I'm not very happy about the emerald one, but, because it does match the other ones, like, I like the fact that they're like, they're like, like, just boxes, sort of. But this one, it doesn't look, it just has that gold trim, which, I find alright, but, meh. Um, also the pistons, I re I'm really happy with the pistons. They look amazing. They look really, like, they look smooth, like, very smooth. And I find that really nice. Um, I also added it so we have bacon instead of, uh, pork chops, but, um, I'm a vegetarian, so I don't eat pork chops, I don't eat bacon, I actually don't eat any meat, so I'll have a melon. There we go. Um, I also added so that the rotten flesh was a brain. I thought that would be kind of fun for everybody. You know, just, just to be fun. The cake I turned into a pizza. I love that. I think that's great. The uh, cookies are now Oreos, which is pretty nice. Uh, the bread is now this nice chopped up loaf of bread. This looks really good. Um, the fish are nice. Golden apples are fine. Um, I think that's the food. Uh, let's get a compass. As you can see, the compass looks really, really... Jeez. Uh, he's... Anyway, um, you can see the nice compass. It looks really, like, really detailed. Like, I have to, I definitely have to give a lot of credit to the people at the Painfully Pack Customizer and the, uh, and the Doku Pack the Doku Mini Customizer, because they actually have really, really, 16 by 16, but really high quality textures here. I really like it. Um, also, um, uh, this looks really cool, this looks really cool, and this looks really cool. Um, these are the end portals. I don't, I don't know if you can, uh, actually make them like, make a portal to the end. I'm not even sure if you can do that. What do you need? I have Ender? I think? Oh, there you go. I don't think you can. You might be able to. No, I didn't think so. Because I knew it. Oh, well. But I'm pretty sure the Ender Dragon is green, which is pretty cool. I think that's neat. Um, the Ender Chests, they look really, really cool. Like, I like the black detail in this and the eyes on the side that just looks just like the inner eyes. I think that looks really good. The ender stone looks really cool, it's just lighter. The cobwebs are like more dirty, which I think is cool. That's basically it, except for watermelons, those look really cool. See that? And that's basically it, that's my, uh, that's my texture pack, if you want to download it, link is in the description. Um, and that's it. My name is Gavin from the Gavin and Callie series, and I will see you all later. Bye.